going on youtube it's cal let's go back from another video today's video is going to be a very quick one i'm just going to show you guys what i use when i have a white jersey um because when you have white it's the absence of color as someone said on my live stream that was very intelligent of them to say um when i was going about going on about it like why is the absence of color so when you do get this color you get a bunch of different artifacts all moving around and all in your jersey so what you want to do is actually desaturate your jersey and this goes for jersey swaps your designs whatever you may be doing think about this when you are going to do a project because it can come in very handy and make your work a lot cleaner than it would be without using this so it's pretty easy all we're going to use today is channel mixer on monochrome you guys see on monochrome channel mixer on monochrome okay but i'm gonna show you guys how to like clip it and stuff just in case you guys are like new to photoshop so uh to add in your channel mixer um all you have to do is go right here to the semicircle right here you're going to add your channel mixer in now it's not going to be check marked to monochrome so check mark it and then you guys see we already have clipping mask but i'm going to do it one more time so you would right click and create the clipping mask now if you know the shortcut you just go to alt or the alt button on the mac i think it's command correct me if i'm wrong but the alt button on the mac i'm just going to say command for the video um but yeah just click that and clip it to your mask okay now, I already have one in, so I'm not going to do it again. But what you would have to do after that is you would invert the mask. And to invert your mask, you press Control I, all right? Control I. Remember, inverting your mask is Control I. Boom. Control I. Invert your mask like that. All right? So you want to invert it to the, the black off rip so that you can paint on with white. So you want to invert it to black so you can paint on with white off rip, okay? Remember that. All right? Remember that. Because white reveals black hides. White reveals black hides. All right. So once you get to that point, you guys see I already painted this on. But like, like I said, black hides and white will reveal what you have. All right. So we set it to monochrome on the channel mixer. Now we're painting on with white. And you're going to have to do this for the jersey. Now I already did this. And you can also use the pen tool if you wanted to do that. But you're just going to have to paint on to the sections to get it desaturated all right so once you guys do that we'll be back now we're back and i know that you probably took a long time to do this but it is a tedious process sometimes because you gotta get all in the creases and everything like that but if you don't want to take the time to do this then i don't know if designing is for you my guy all right so after you do that you're going to add on top of that a solid fill color all right so I have a solid fill color on top of this and we're going to do the same thing. You go down to the adjustments and choose your solid color right here. Make sure it's all the way to the left desaturated all the way to the left desaturated when you choose this. All right. Boom. Press OK. All right. Cool. Now create a clipping mask again. Right click. Create your clipping mask again. OK. So in that case, that's what you would do. Now, the only thing that you have to remember is that you have uh, two clipping masks on here, but you would have no mask. You would have a dis disabled mask. Like it would just want to even be coexistent. So what you have to do to replace your mask and use the same mask from this to here is hold down alt and drag it and replace the mask like this. See how I'm dragging this mask? You hold down alt and you can replace mask just like this. Boom. So you're going to replace that mask. Now it's going to be there. And now at this point, um, you can change, you can move around your color to make it brighter or darker and make sure your blending mode is on linear light. All right. Linear light really works for me when I'm doing this, put it on linear light. Okay. And now here's the final step. You're pretty much done, but just make sure everything looks like how you want it to look you just gotta add a little bit of adjustments you might have to add a little bit of adjustments here um take some take some of the shade take some of the shade off take some of the saturation on um anything like that just clean clean up your mask and make sure it looks good now when you are all set and you have like everything like just desaturated and it looks a lot better um you're pretty much done but i just want to show you guys the importance of this because say if i were to Say if I were to take this this mask right here and add skins on it. All right, so I'm just gonna add some skins. Go to Topaz Labs. I'm gonna add Dynamic Pop, and I'm gonna add Light Pop Smooth. All right, boom. So I add Dynamic Pop and Light Pop Smooth, but look at those colors. Look at that, man. That looks awful. You got like purple down here, yellow up here, like blue green. Like 
what's going on bro you you guys just see the color thing going crazy so if you were to just clip these on like we did and we we got ready for this we clip these on and you guys see everything's desaturated everything's looking way better and then when you have masks you can just go on and keep messing around and keep uh changing these out so yeah man that's gonna do it for the video you guys see my stuff's pretty messy but i just wanted to bring this to you guys uh pretty quickly um even though i said take your time yes you guys need to take your time because i've done this plenty of times before so please don't make fun of my mask in the comments but just take your time with your mask and you guys see the difference man like look at it it's night and day it's night and day man and this is a really good tip and i think you guys should share it with your friends if they do swaps or anything like that um it will definitely help and this also goes for black because black doesn't take as many colors in but it can also be tinted you guys see, will see it a lot of times tinted with a blue or a purple just a dark shade of a color um but yeah man so that's gonna do it for the video if it helped you guys out let me know down below um drop a like drop a comment let me know man until next time it's been cow so scoped and i'm signing out man stay scoped peace